Hi everyone, I'm going to do something totally different. Um, I'm going to be doing the chain pull. And as you can see, I've done these here on different backgrounds. Um, the darker one with the gold and the white. And then this one on a white background with the purple gold on that one. And then I did a, just a plain uh, pink. And that one has got your gold, your purple and your white. So I'm going to get um, a nail and uh, I'm going to show you how I did it on a nail. So uh, I'll get things sorted. Well before I do I'll show you. I'm going to be using um, acrylic paint. Now when you're using acrylic paint on your nails obviously it doesn't dry as quick. Um, so what I use is the air dryer. That's the easy simple way. Um, so the gold is a metallic gold from Folk Art and then this one's Americana which is the white and I do have purple somewhere about but it's the same. Um, I'll have to get that. So uh, them are the three I'll be using. Um, on the background I don't know whether I should be using just a plain purple or uh, this is a mix which was this one in there so it's just a mix that I did um, and then obviously um, that'll be acrylic so um, I'll find me purple wherever it's gone and I'll be back <laughs> Now while those are drying, um, you could obviously um, the chain that you use is uh, your preference. This is a, a small chain and then this one's a little bit larger. So I'm going to do uh, one nail with the larger chain and one with the small one. And then I've got a little plastic bag that I'm going to put, um, this was the one that I used with the purple. So, let me get that off there. Don't want to get it all over me. So I'm going to put a blob of that one. And a purple. Screw it up again. And the white. I've decided to use the, this white. It doesn't really make much difference which you use, whichever you prefer, but that is open. So, and then the gold, um, that's a block of that one as well. So, we've got white, purple, and gold. And the brush I'm going to be using to put it on is one of Born Pretty's, and it's um, a long fine one. I found it easier for me to control with it being a finer brush. So once these have um, dried then we will start the chain pull.
So when you've finished, like I say, use air dryer uh, on your fingers if you're going to do it that way and um, then top coat it and there you have it. Well, I hope you've enjoyed this video and thank you so much for watching and hopefully see you in my next. Bye.